These women really knew me. One of them was from Minnesota. I didn't even know they had... So, after weeks, I finally show him the picture of my mother. But that's not enough, because her name has been changed in the will. That is quite a storyline. Well, you ask. It's meaty, isn't it? It is. I just wish watching TV during the day didn't make me feel so guilty. I had a miscarriage. Did you get the pages? No. Are you two rehearsing already? Call me when you see them. <laughs> <laughs> Darling, you shouldn't smoke so much. The weight you lose isn't worth the wrinkles. See, I think the sponsors are for the war. They don't want to have any dissent. Don, you're a writer. You know, this is censorship. I am a writer, and I'm against the war, but when you buy a commercial, you're hoping that the consumer is in a good mood when they hear your message. So if you agree on a wholesome variety show and all of a sudden it's filled with satire, the most threatening humor there is, you're worried about people hating what you're selling. Megan, let's talk about you and how you found this man. <laughs> I could cast you. You know that. Yes, I'm sure he's a man who plays many roles. <laughs> Luckily, you don't have to worry about censorship with the show because it's so tame. Of course, it's for daytime entertainment. It's for housewives. It has to be a little titillating. We have our own standards, although they've been very liberal with us. But you know, when we do things on the show, it's all very tasteful. Well, it's not real life. <laughs> Why don't you let me get the check? Go back to our pad, smoke some grass, and see what happens. Sounds like fun. I don't know. It's. T'es pas encore prête? This is my day off. We had plans. Alors, tu veux très mieux passer les soirées avec ta mère que d'aller dans un restaurant chic avec ton mari. Well, you would rather spend the evening laughing at Roger's drilling jokes. I should return home. I've overstayed my welcome. No, maman, c'est pas toi. Je suis contente que tu sois là. He's so far away that sometimes when we're alone, I feel like I'm making conversation. <laughs> I love coming. Hmm. It was. Oh, it was terrible. I don't even know if I want to talk about it. What's for dinner? I think they hate me. They just gave you a second part. I feel like an idiot because they keep telling me they can't tell the twins apart. I think I'm playing them very differently. It's not like it's never been done before. Exactly. I told Mel I didn't want to be a cliche. And he starts rapping about how they're two halves of the same person, and they want the same thing, but they're trying to get it in different ways. Listen, would you mind if we just go in and turn on the set? I'm really not hungry. Did you have a bad day? I'm just tired. Go lay down. I'll clean up. I already packed your bag for Bobby's camp. Stupid for thinking you could possibly miss me. I do miss you. No, you don't. I should fly in and surprise you. Yeah, that's a scary thought, isn't it? No. Really? You're never there when I call? And you always have to call me back? And it's always quiet? Where is it quiet in that office? And I've never even heard a typewriter. That's not true. Yes, it is true. I'm sorry I had to interrupt your love affairs with the disaster of my career. Megan, sit down. I was your secretary, remember? I know what you're like when you're left alone. You lost your job? Don't worry, I'm still getting paid. <laughs> I don't give a shit. When did this happen? Right after you left. They fired you last year. Why didn't you tell me? I 
Are you there? Yes. Good for you. I don't know if I can undo it, but I think I fixed it. I fixed it as you got a job out here. That's what you promised me. That's why I'm here. I can't believe after all this time you don't know me. I know how I want you to see me. Don't lie to me. Don't do that. You can't do that. I'm your wife. Stop pushing me away with both hands. <laughs> not now. It's not a good idea. I love you. Good night. Why am I explaining myself to you? I'm tired of asking for an allowance. Can we just sign the papers and be done with this? Your lawyer is very aggressive. That's not how I heard it. I'm starting to think you're enjoying this. Well, my finances are a mess since the McCann deal. You were a millionaire when I met you. Just tell your lawyer he won. Sign whatever you want. Can't live like this. This is what they do, honey. How much do you need right now? I'll leave a check. 500? Who's moving you? The New York Jets? I have to go. Mm. You may find the time by dialing Meridian 7 1212. Fine. I don't think you. This is why I never invite you to How was the night on the town with Harry Crane? Educational. You know what would make you feel better? Drugs. <laughs> Tired. But you just got here. Go to bed. Because the fun. You have my number. <laughs>